Hey everybody, Mr. Linky here, and today we will be taking out the Porsche 917K for a test on Blue City. But remember, uh, go to w.gg and use code Mr. Linky, all caps, for a 10% discount uh, for your next order. But besides that, hope you guys have been getting the cars you want, and it's kind of cool that I got this one. So I'm gonna go in a garage for a quick second because. I didn't do the like how much horsepower they have anyway but it's interesting because the Sauber C9 820 horsepower Mazda 691 but the Porsche 572 but it's an S plus class now too so this Porsche might be the fastest S plus class car and you can't customize it at all still so yeah might as well just take this out on Blue City and see what's gonna happen La da da da. Uh, I always feel like I'm going crazy because Blue City used to be like literally. I don't even think I had to even scroll. I think it was just like click. It was right there on my far right. <laughs> so many updates. Uh, three laps. ABS off. Steer assist off. Semi slicks. Oh, so there is no slicks. Um, why? I feel like I should just keep it. You yeah, know, fuck it. And that is weird. Semi slicks. Okay, so. Yeah. Hopefully, everyone's day has been going great. And hopefully, you got the cars you want. And hopefully, you've been enjoying my uh, Tesla videos. Sorry about the Mazda video. That was. I don't know. I could have went faster, but it was just sketchy because I didn't want to spin it out. <laughs> like I almost did with the Sauber really hard. But, let's get at this. I <laughs> shouldn't have put that, uh, yeah, I feel like I should have just kept the anti-roll bar on the front to nine, I think. Holy, that, that's a stiff car. That, I, and that noise it was making, 
that noise was I, I don't know if you guys will hear it on the video but every time I was full gunning it there was kind of this like vroom, 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 sound that kind of keep like it kept I kept fucking hearing it and it kept making me lose my concentration but then I was also noticing that the thing was short geared so I'm like if I go to second gear it's way too low if I go to third it's way too much I'm pretty sure I did see that it was tunable gearing but holy that this is yeah this is the worst car I think maybe there's just I don't know maybe it's because I put the anti roll bar to one fully I don't know but I will definitely do some messing around with this car and see if I can figure it out because it's it's definitely stiffer than the Sauber it's nowhere near the Mazda turning but it's like way worse than this but the, I guess that's what you get with an old 80s car and you take off all these <laughs> well not 80s 70s right this is 70s oh if I click the right damn thing I like I didn't even really knew like I've known about this car but I just didn't know the year I knew more about the Sauber C9 and Mazda but hope you guys enjoyed this video I've been kind of rambling on a little too much because I'm just trying to like I don't know that noise still that the car was making was probably the biggest distraction of the whole thing like I probably could have drove it better but constantly hearing that in my ear just just I don't know why it just kept throwing me off every time I was <laughs> just trying to push the car but hope you enjoyed the video and until next time peace